Tiffany, you're pretty Tiffany, 24 years old, isn't that great? Well, Tiffany, you, you got everything going for you, you're very pretty. Everything's nice and tight and smooth, everything's shiny. Right where it's supposed to be. That's because you're 24, honey. But Tiffany, I, I got a little surprise for you. Yeah. Oh, it's coming, Tiffany, yeah, it's coming. You have no idea what's coming, Tiffany, but time and gravity's gonna show up one day and screw all that up for you, Tiffany. Here's your picture, this is it, this is what it looks like. I'm, I'm 25. No, I'm twice that plus. But it's a lot of work now. I have a grandmother now, Tiffany, and everything is more work. How long did it take Tiffany to get all pretty tonight? Let's compare. Five minutes. Oh but you just want to punch her. <laughs> I had to start on Tuesday, Tiffany. Oh, there's a lot of stuff I gotta do. I gotta tape stuff and talking stuff. You know what I had to do today, Tiffany? I bet you didn't have to do. Today, I had to pluck my eyebrows out of my chin. <laughs> That's all my life is now, is hair control. <laughs> I spend an hour every morning checking every inch of my body going, where's that son of a gun coming out of today? And today was my knuckle. Oh my God! Big old hair coming out of my knuckle. I think I'm so afraid that I'm gonna turn into my mother, I'm turning into my father. <laughs> And I gotta go to the spa, it's expensive to be old, Tiffany. Get it all done. I got it all done at the Bellagio Spa last Tuesday. It cost me a fortune, I was there all day. Got the sandblasting and the spackle. Ever get your butt spackled, Tiffany? Nah. Then I went in there, the first thing the guy starts doing, he's walking around me with a mirror. Oh, you got rust. <laughs> and I used to be fun. 24 years old, Tiffany, I was fun. I bet you're fun. I used to be fun, I used to do fun stuff. I used to run marathons. I used to show horses, jumping horses over six foot fences. I used to, I used to mountain climb, water ski. I never got hurt. Now, a little different. Last week here in Las Vegas, I screwed up my back. Ended up in the emergency room all night. You know how I did it, Tiffany? I slept funny. <laughs> Right here, I'll piss all over the stage. <laughs> Things I used to enjoy, I can't enjoy anymore. I used to love going shopping. Shopping in Las Vegas is fantastic. I used to go to the malls, can't go to the malls anymore, can't go in those little boutiques. They all look at me like I'm lost. <laughs> yeah, I went in that Forever 21 store, the lady's like, oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Well, you don't have a Forever 55 store. Where the heck am I supposed to go? <laughs> Went into Victoria's Secret. <laughs> oh, wow. Found out what the secret is. <laughs> that stuff don't look good on my old butt. Yeah. <laughs> Dating's not... You got a man there, Tiffany? You got a man in your life? Nope. Nope? Got love in your life at all? Sometimes it's a woman, which I just love as love. I'm a single gal, I'm a single gal. Where are my single eligible men in the crowd? Over there. How old are you? 21. Ooh, that's a, that's a little old. What's your name, honey? Tom. Tom. Did you ever have sex with a red-headed comedian before? Carrot Top doesn't count, Tom. <laughs> You have had custard? No, I think I remember you from the Facebook pictures, yeah. <laughs> it's been a while, Tom, since I've had a date. 
Last, uh, last time was last uh, 4th of July here in Las Vegas. I was at a party here. My friends were throwing a party. I went to the party. It was 118 degrees. Yeah, and they had frozen margaritas to keep cool by the pool, and I had like 17 of them. <laughs> Next thing I know, I got pretty intoxicated, and a man walked up to me and said, Kathleen, Susan's asked me to give you a ride home. We think you might have had too much to drink. I said, well, well <laughs> hmm. I think we all know what that means. Ah! <laughs> this guy was hot, about six foot one, bang. 200 pounds, bang, bang. 17 years younger than me, snap. <laughs> Now we get to my house, it's about one o'clock in the morning while I was at the party, my air conditioner blew out. It's 103 degrees in my house, I don't care. I'm still doing this guy, when, when's this happening again? I've got a live one in the living room. There's just one problem, I'm so drunk, it's so hot, it's been so long, I don't know what I'm doing. I can't remember my move. Right, Tiffany? Right, right, Kim? Kim, we all have our own move to let our men know when we want some loving. Young girl like Kim, it's probably like a sexy look you give <laughs> Kim, you've been together for a little longer, it's more of a gesture. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I've been married a really long time, it's like, get the hell in here and tell me! I don't care if you're wearing your socks, come on! <laughs> I have my own move, it's never let me down. I, I just can't remember it. I'm just looking at the guy. <laughs> Finally, I remembered it. Thank God. I said, all right, baby. All right, baby. I'm ready now. Here it comes. Here it comes. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Come here. I won't spit on you. Come here. <laughs> you want to have some of this? Before we do this, I need to tell you a couple of things. Number one, I'm a little older than you, and number two, I'm kind of fat. So I'm, I'm what you call menopausal. He says, I don't know what that means. I go, awesome. You know, it's like 102 in here right now. Well, any minute, I'm gonna have a hot flash. And then it'll be about 174. And we can bake some cookies. And then I'll start crying. And then I'll stab you. You still want to spend the night with me? He says, what kind of cookies? 